lovely. And I came your way this evening, an emergency, based on the hula ballo that just popped a few days ago. You people know that I'm not the talking type and I don't like talking. But I found myself in the midst of a, something I never bargained for, but I'm prepared for it by God. I am a man that doesn't like it, but I respect myself. You can't see me doing nonsense in that careless people may do. Because I need to respect myself. I don't like insults. But I come to grand community at this point in time, become like Jesus. There was a time everybody singing praises of Apostle Ken. All of a sudden, the whole thing changed. The same people that, they, that they shouted the Hosanna and said, crucify him. I'm not a talk. That's the price of a leader. If the leader goes up goes up and down, keep on going where he's going. One thing I want to remind you people today, I'm just a man on a mission. From the exception of this very ground that calls itself UAD, I never tell anybody that I have a grant and I, I went for a grant. You all, if you want to be sincere and truthful to yourself, you know the beginning. It is some people who are now persecuting me that went out to find the root cause of this very grant. In my way of doing things, I don't run from pillar to post. They find out that, yes, they found out this is this. I spent my money. I spent a lot of money. I need to know what this is all about if I get myself involved. Fortunately, the people that encourages me say it is true. We found the document, your name is there. And now the same people saying different things. And I came in with, an, with the spirit of a servant to, to serve. To serve Nigeria and my country. To make sure that things work well. I put in everything within my capacity. And then all along the way, I came out on 9th of March, 2023, under the leadership of stakeholders, announced and bringing data. We're not going to use the data of another NGO. Hell will be let loose. I have from external forces. Courage. And many people uh, here know with you are, the battle turn around from the invest to stop it. I call everyone I can call within the center of the problem. Now I want to make something threat. All grand pressure groups under the leadership of do our Abdul is like my own brainchild. They are very close to me. They are like sons. They are like junior brothers. We're working. But only God knows what is in the heart of a man. And they were giving me encouragement we are going along. And then I remember one day they told me God has answered our prayer. We find a door to get to this things. We all went together. The negotiation started after we have wasted money from different channels. And we saw this very rich channel. I had a an event note calling Samuel Abbasi as extortioner as all kinds of things. Ladies and gentlemen, he is not working on himself. He has his bosies within his team. They are the people who came to help and we found truth in them. They didn't charge us money like other things we have put out there before. But they said they are going to help us get this thing out. 
we decide whatever to appreciate them. There was no negotiation. There was no no issue of any payment. For somebody now to come and talk about and mentioning somebody's name, these men and women are busy people. They introduce Samuel Abbasi to us as the person communicating us and reporting to them. And they're holding meetings and sending him back to us. I don't want to set the community on fire. There are things I will say with evidence. Forget about all the way that is backing like a hungry lion. Everything he said, he was not there. If Nigerians are sensible and men that written well, few days ago they celebrated their victory according to them. Turning me to Southeast Coordinator. Nobody challenged them. All of a sudden, you turn and back in like a wounded lion. I think there's something you are not telling Nigeria that you are. Winners don't make noise. It's always losers that make noise looking for reason why they lose. I was quiet, even as a coordinator. I didn't say anything. Because I have learned in my leadership all my life to learn how to be under authority. And as far as this grant is concerned, I am under authority too. These are people who come to rescue me. Some embassy did not collect 20 million, 40 million, whatever from me. There was nothing like that. Somebody who was not there, everything he was saying, you listen. He was saying what he was told. He just said somebody who had been brainwashed and turned to be a slave. He's talking like he's on his own. He was set like a robot to go around. So I want to tell you people, all those things was rubbish. This group that is helping us now did not collect such money from me. I did not pay Abbasi. I did not give him any money to save for me. They have done everything to get me out of the point. But you can bring down a man who you raise up, not somebody that God raise up. In all they do, it doesn't work. They now come to creatures everywhere. After their celebration, ask them two days ago they were celebrating. Is there any other meeting that has happened between me and them or between the 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 the, 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 the committee helping us? No other meeting. That means they have something they, they are hiding they need to tell Nigerians. But that is that to that. My involvement in the grant, all of you know, through St. Twitter, who include my name, and the husband misunderstood me and fought me, but I think a no issue between me and him. We didn't understand ourselves. That's why I've not gone offensive to anybody. I've only been on defensive way. And I'm a man that God's hand is upon, if you don't know. I want to use this opportunity, I will make this in straight to tell you, Abbasi did not collect money from me. Abbasi did not turn anything against them. Rather, he was fully following protocol. I don't want to do scatter the whole community. If not, I know what to That has, that has kept us where we are, but God will settle that. And i like to give you uh, this words to look at, because every time people are jumping up with a threat, collected money, that the 5K we pay, let me announce to you that every record of that money that enter my hand is documented by my accounting. The reasonable authority want to see how it does. I will present it. The 10 k which I, I asked earlier before that fact to pay for this the, for the app and do so many things and logistics. The record is there, and this 35 k you all knows what happened between me, us, and Pesta. When Pesta started paying, some have been discovered for 150 million to run the 
verification. When it was impossible, we came together. So let's approach the CEOs. Many of you knew what I'm saying. You borrowed us money, some, let us say, it, it just forget about it. But it was borrowed that added, the investment will return back your money. Before you know it, accusation again. And I, I, I made up to 400 million, some say billion. And I bought four houses in one empire. Where I'm living in Guadalupe, packed packed in there by June. Anything about that money happened between October. I think within October. But I'm very, very sorry. Having learned that I'm working in the mix of people who reasoning are not in my own level. So many of them. I'm not in all. When they see one, they make it 200. All the things we are saying that were saying against me, I didn't bother until recently. The reason I came here is to let you know, Nigerian community, if you really, we really want money, we should learn to behave mature. This money or this fund should have been disbursed late last year. Just nearly, it couldn't come. By January, instead of disbursement, the hidden hearts of men were revealed. I never know that people claiming to be helping me are fighting to snatch the grant and be the one to disburse it. People that went, that they went for me, went for their own selfishness, lying upon lying upon lying against me. The authority know I have never reported anybody. I have never sent message to anybody. God is my witness. I have never complained about anybody. But they keep on complaining. I stood so low, even that that shit. Let it this, this thing work. Let me go and rest. But I don't know what is a man in the heart of a man, but God knows. They keep raising dust from one junction to another, from one junction to another. The more they raise this dust, the more they are making me stronger in the process. And I want to say this. This grant, nobody has taken it and nobody will take it. I'm not boasting. I'm a man on mission. God sent me. Anybody can say anything. It's God who knows who we are. The Lord who sent me to this is supporting me. I am still in charge. But the only difference now is all this accusation. Government decides to make it their grant. They took over. That is where Abba becomes in. To be in charge of the grant, to be reporting to government, to oversee whatever we are going to do, I am still in the system of this grant. If anybody tells you that I'm not there, he's just deceiving you, I'm in charge for yourself. But I'm the only one that can defend your interests, not any other ones that are pretending to be for the masses. Somebody made a statement from the team that's opposing me. It's better for them to stay two more years as long as it's not a possible game. Let me announce to you, you can't remove somebody you did not put in any position. It is God that put me here. And I want to plead to every one of you, lay down your arms, let us get this money. The more you are shout every right of every GM, government has intelligence over every way. They are hearing it. All these things will not help us. I want to do this program not because of this email that just came out. I've always done it to, to help this program to plead to us to be calm. This thing is about entering our hands. We know the last meeting we had and what we were told. 
any of this dragging here and there. We are taking motions that the government may decide on the match. And I am not the one to hold responsible. If anything go wrong in the process of this grant, hold all grant pressure group responsible. Because I've never made any trouble. They are the ones creating this trouble. But I'm pleading to all of you partners. Talk to them and be calm. This grant is coming out. Enough of this nonsense. A sick psychopath will come out and insult me anyhow I like. These are people that cannot look at my face and talk. Just because of cheap data and Android phone. You're not supposed to be talking as if you are somebody. Ask them what are they doing before grants? What is their job in Abuja? Where are they living in Abuja? Who is paying the house rent they are living? We've been here since before many years before grants. And we are feeding and eating without grants. Please, I've taken enough shit. If you're a mature, reasonable man, just ask yourself. What is the secret behind celebration and crying after a day or two? There's something that is deceiving you people. There was reason they do that all their celebration could not change the instance of what is going on. They came out to rant and to accuse me, to insult me, to show manners of it, even to show, insult a gentleman that is laboring for the good of Nigeria, calling him names. I'm here to let Nigerians know that everything always said against the chairman of the government committee, Sam Amasi, is all lie. I'm not saying it because he's an evil, I'm an evil. I'm not saying it because I want to defend him. I'm telling you the truth. The group did not collect such money from us at all. We did not, they did not extort us. We suffered that in the time past, in the wrong hand. But in these hands, we have never suffered such a thing. But they are the one putting their money, putting their money and time to make things work. They break us together. Even before, so that we can dispose of this money, everybody rest. They are enemies of this grant inside the country. I mean, inside the system. That doesn't want this money to be dispersed. Government is interested to give us this money to live in poverty in Nigeria. The wealth of Nigeria is important to the government, and they are willing to do it. Let us stop disturbing the process with all these grand things. Someone just woke up, he, took, he will take phone because he, 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 he can talk, he has data. From 2016, he started talking. What have you achieved? He started taking comrades and titles. What have you achieved? Please, I plead to every one of you, partners, this thing has never happened in Nigeria, and it's about to happen. Let's join our forces together to resist the devil. Let this thing come out. I cannot say some things in public domain, but it's only a fool that opened up all his arsenal in the public. God has already settled this in. All we need to do don't provoke the devil by all these will ballots. If we can be quiet, we would see this money soon in our hands. I know that after now, a lot of analysis will go. There are people who don't have work. All they have is to post in social media. But be patient. God will put money in your hand. You'll find something to do. So that all this nonsense will be over. But fighting here, fighting here, who is fit to disburse the money who is not fit and I'm mobilizing people supporters club here and there to fight Apostle Ken that one stupid person that calls herself a lawyer come to write nonsense about South Southeast some of these people if you ask them where they come from you will understand who they are I am a born Omaha person that's where I come from I'm a Southeasterner. So anybody buying you to start ranting, is not doing you good. Besides, I'm not a state co uh, regional coordinator. I'm not. 
I'm not the original coordinator of party. Even though they have called me that, no problem. All I want is let this thing happen so that I can rest. The shoe I'm wearing, if you wear half of it, half leg, you will know what I'm going through. But the Lord has prepared me before now. I beg you, see you post. You're a leader. Control yourself and control the people. So I've come to the end of all this Ula Balo. That is why I decided to come out. Everybody will come, everybody will listen. Let's not on ourselves allow the devil to use us and destroy the blessing that is coming before us. Voice notes cannot bring the money. Updates cannot bring the money. What will bring the money is quietness for God to finish what he's doing. The, the committee are working their night. All our people that are helping us are committed to this disbursement. But these things are drawing their effort back. And I came out here to talk to you, knowing fully well the authorities are hearing me. I have not instigated problem for the first time. And I want to say now, forgive one another. I am not angry with all pressure, all grand pressure group. They are just doing what they can do. They are just trying to be what they want to be. But I want to say this. I am not fighting anybody. And I want to stand on this to make a comment on the list that was flying this morning. It didn't come from me, and I don't have anything to do with that list. I've told you people in this platform, anybody that registered, duly registered, will surely get this grant. So I'm not using my position to revenge on anybody who may have assaulted me or do one other thing. That is not my person. So whoever that formed that list, send it out. He just wants to throw bomb in the, in the ecosystem and create chaos again so that people start fighting each other. I've done more than that. What is it that insulted me? I'm in position to share grant to you. I didn't give you because you insulted me. I'm above that. I'm too big than that kind of nonsense. So I won't do such a thing. This kind of list is not coming from me nor from anybody. I want to say to you, if you listen to me this morning, this night, I'm not deceiving you. I'm too big to be deceiving people. I've never deceived before. I'm a servant of God, called by God. And I'm doing my work. Everybody around me knows who I am. But there are people who are far from me, who are who have been paid, paid agents. I like to bring this to your understanding. Look around the people fighting me. You know they all come from the same place. Out of envy, how can it be him? May the Lord give every one of you understanding. We we'll have to fight this battle together by kicking the devil out to tell him where he belongs. We have suffered. For good cases, Nigeria has been on, hanging on the air for granted. This one is visible and it's about to rain. Please control yourself. And I stand on this platform to say, all you, my lovers, please. Don't retaliate for me for now. Don't go see your thoughts. We don't need noise now. What we need is allow the committee finish the last thing they need to do now and call upon us for this judgment. I believe God that we're going to hear that good news. Please don't fight for me. Don't fight for me. Even if they rose up now to start fighting, I didn't send anybody to fight for me. God is the one that will finish this work. And it is about to rain. God bless you all. Thank you so much. I will spend a few minutes to hear any question that are relevant and reasonable. I will answer it. But the one that come out of insult, I won't take it. Thank you all. God bless you. Pastor B, God bless you. Thank you very much, sir. Your Excellency. Thank you.